Hi everyone, welcome to Apple Tech page. In this tutorial, I will show you how to fix unable to complete Touch ID setup. Please go back and try again error on iPhone and iPad. Solution 1 is make sure that your finger and home button are dry. You cannot set up your Touch ID if your finger and home button are not clean and dry. If your finger and home button are oily or sweat, your iPhone shows this error while setting up your Touch ID. So before making a Touch ID, clean them using a dry cloth. Solution 2 is Turn on iPhone Unlock and iTunes and App Store. Go to Settings app. Next, scroll down the screen and tap on Touch ID and Passcode. Then enter the passcode of your device. Now turn on iPhone Unlock and iTunes and App Store. If these features are turned on already, then turn off them and restart your iPhone. Once you restarted, turn on these features again. Solution 3 is turn on rest finger to open. First, go to settings app. Next, find and tap on accessibility. Now scroll down the screen and tap on home button. Here, turn on rest finger to open. If it's already turned on, then turn off and on it. Solution 4 is Reset All Settings. When you do Reset All Settings, your customized settings will be deleted. Tap on Settings icon from the home screen. Now scroll down and tap on General. Again scroll down the screen and tap on Reset. Here you have to tap on reset all settings. Then enter the passcode of your iPhone or iPad if prompted. Next, you will get a pop-up window to confirm this process or not. Here, tap on reset all settings to confirm this process. Solution 5 is first restart your iPhone or iPad. If you are using iPhone 7 and 7 Plus, then do the following steps. Press and hold the side button and volume down button at the same time until you see the Apple logo. If you are using iPhone 6s Plus and earlier models, an iPad with home button, then do the following steps to post restart. Press and hold the home button and sleep or wake button at the same time until you're getting the Apple logo. Solution 6 is sign out of iTunes and App Store and sign in back. One of iPhone users said that signing out of iTunes and App Store and sign back in help you to get rid of this issue. To do this, go to settings app. Next, Scroll down the screen to find iTunes and App Store. Now tap on your Apple ID. Then tap on sign out in the pop-up window. Next, restart your device and sign back into iTunes and App Store. Solution 7 is add a new fingerprint. Launch settings app. Now tap on Touch ID and Passcode. Next, enter your device's passcode. Tap on Add a fingerprint. Make sure that your finger and home button are clean and dry. Then follow the on-screen instructions to set up a Touch ID. Solution 8 is Update iOS of your iPhone or iPad. First, make sure that your device is connected to Wi-Fi, then launch settings app. 
Now scroll down the screen and tap on general. Next tap on software update. If new version iOS is available, tap on download and install. Thanks for watching. Do like, share and subscribe to Apple Tech page.